driving home today, which means, <laughs> which means I get to see Alex. And I could not be more excited about that. Because I've been a big pile of crap sitting here by her this whole Listen, time. Listen, it has nothing to do with you. It has nothing to do with my like or dislike of you. It has everything to do with the fact that I miss my hubby. And, I miss mine too. And spooning with him and running my fingers through his chest hair and poking his nose and licking his ear and TMI. what else? What else do I want to do? I don't even think you want to say it on the camera. <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> um, we got a really late start as usual, as usual <laughs> because grandpa wanted to like take pictures and he had it in his mind. He wanted to take pictures outside. So Ginger was like, and crying and oh man. And then we still had to stop at the gas station get ice and then we had to stop and get um, breakfast burritos. And Alex told me not to make this a journal and not to like summarize things that we just did. But too bad that's what just happened because I couldn't vlog. We were stressed out trying to get things done. So now we're on the road and it's gonna look like this for quite some time. Just the road, the plains, the occasional red rocks. Oh, I do want to tell the fans what we're reading today. Oh, crap. You're not going to believe this. We went to Marshall's last night to look for some shoes since I wore a hole through my Crocs. I can't believe I wore a hole through my Crocs. Is this a cop? I am going almost 100, so no, I really, really hope this is a It's just a truck. And um, she grabs this book. <laughs> I've been crap. wanting to read it. I read the beginning of it on my my Samsung Galaxy tablet, which I do like. That was a plug. That was a plug. <laughs> and then I just didn't purchase it, but then I saw it last night and I thought, well, look, I can have the hard copy for my beautiful bookcase that I don't have at home. So she's going to read that to me. It was $26 Yay. and I got it for $3.99. I wonder why. All things Kardashian. All things Kardashian. Who's jealous of me? You know, Kris Jenner's an awesome momager. A momager. She's a momager, she just said. She is. She's a mom and a manager. Momager. Ah. Heading, heading into Arizona. Wait, did we miss the sign? <clears throat> well, we saw that little Arizona state line, but this place has like animals on top of their mountain here and the restroom in there is disgusting. I know because I stopped there once and here comes the sign. literally Ready? wanted to puke. Stay. Did you get the picture? I did but no. I didn't get Arizona. No. <laughs> Darcy, you know what I got? This part of the car. <laughs> oh my gosh, how hard did we try? <laughs> I pushed play instead of take the picture. <laughs> Push the wrong button. So I was trying to go back and right then we passed it and it lovely. We should I want to book it. I should keep it. I picture. am and I'm gonna I'm gonna ask Alex to put a picture of that inside the video so you can see the exact picture I took because it's thrilling. It's titillating. It should go in a in an award winning picture magazine and a coffee table book on amazing pictures of state signs because it's it's awesome. It's great. Didn't you see Brigham? Mm -hmm. oh. Hurry, get in. Myra, push him over. <laughs> Go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mommy, I need to Oh man. That was in my face. Try to drop it? Yeah, just drop it. It's oh. Give me a car. I'll give it. Hey, Hurry, sit down. Yeah. Oh, let's go. Yeah. Say, Ginger, give me my car. Oh, give me my the car. Hand that goes to it. Are you enjoying this very, very long ride? Is Myra enjoying it? <laughs> That's a Is good Ginger part. enjoying it? No. Hey, you've got the iPad. You should be enjoying it. I'm not. When I was little, I didn't have no iPad. I didn't have no movies to watch. Ginger? This is his car. Kay. You do not take it from him. Okay. Break him, say thank you. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, that was my, <laughs> I just <laughs> didn't mean to do that. This 
is not a good sign. Oh my god! A minute ago, it said road work ahead, and then it stopped the traffic. This is not. And then Darcy said she was sleepy, so I slapped her in the face. Because earlier she punched me in the eye. I did. <laughs> Tara said she was sleepy. So I went like this. <gasps> no! You just punched me in the first! <laughs> Good one! Okay, here's a mile sign. We are 98 miles! Okay, look at my bruises, everybody. <laughs> look at my bruises. 98 miles. Look at my bruises. You, she just pinched me in my underarm, and you know what? <laughs> Payback's a, hmm, you know what? And let me just say, <laughs> let me let me unzoom because. Payback's a boo. Okay, <laughs> we have children subscribers. I said a birch. <laughs> it's true. Hey. This has been her thing this week. It has been pinching me here in the Wait soft... Wait a minute. Just and this it hurts. week? We've been doing this for months. Years, probably. But it's been especially potent this week because then Jason got in on the action. And he bruised And me. he's been the one bruising her. I haven't bruised you, have I? You don't know what you've done. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> We're getting stir crazy, people. We're getting stir crazy. I know, and we still have at least five more hours. <laughs> What'd she do? <laughs> Did she put her lollipop stick on your chest? On me. <laughs> I'm gonna be it's my... on <laughs> me. I'm gonna be my... <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hi, husband. Would you like to know what my sister just did? No. <laughs> no, she didn't fart, but that's a nice guess. She stuck her lollipop right on my chest and peeled it off. I lift it extra good to make sure it's nice and sticky. We are and you know what's the sad part? I can't even do anything because she's driving and I don't want to like ruin the... <laughs> oh. My. Hey. You got the light. Let go, let go of it, let go of it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and do you see, Myra, you see how Brigham is treating Ginger? This is my Brigham, right here. My Brigham, right here. Should I go, Ginger, mommy's sticking lollipops on my face. Mommy. Ooh, there's the what? Pincher. Such a pincher. Even Brigham said, yeah. cooped all day in the car so we stopped for um, we stopped for dinner at Cracker Barrel our last chance eating Cracker Barrel for quite a while and so I'm letting the kids blow some steam while we wait for our food to cook and um, instead of running around on the grass like I thought he would he's just sitting what she's been doing all day so I don't get that
Darcy and the kids have been on their way home from Albuquerque all freaking day. I got to sleep in and it was wonderful. My mom came over, we cleaned up a little bit around the house. I did the dishwasher, took out the trash. Oh my face itches right there. Took out the trash, um, folded like four baskets of laundry, put them away. Uh, what else did I do? Did, uh, did I say the dishwasher? I said the dishwasher. And now I am going to take this and break it down. That, well, I'm not gonna break it, but this is the bassinet that I came home to when I was a baby. My dad's, it was made for me from one of my grandparents' friends, I believe. My grandparents' friend made it for me for when I was born. Isn't that awesome? And it's, um, it rocks. It's got this rocking thing and it's got the, the cotton logo because of our last name. And then when Ginger was born, my dad had this mattress created. Um, so that it wasn't because they didn't have the old mattress from when I was little. I was sitting up in the rafters of my parents' house for 27 years, 26 years. When the hell? I don't know how old I was when I had Ginger. She's five now, and I'm 30. 25 years. Is that right? That can't be right. Holy crap! Okay. Anyway, so I'm gonna eventually. I'm gonna put that on the garage right now and take it apart again, and then we can use it for our next baby. Uh, but for now, I have to put this together because Hazel has gotten too big for the bassinet. That little girl bon bronx around in her uh, bassinet and um, gets her head or her arm out over the bassinet and then kind of gets stuck there. And then it sits usually up against um, a dresser or something. So she gets her arm pinned between the dresser. She doesn't ever hurt herself, but it's, we don't want her to. So uh, obviously we're gonna take whatever steps we can as parents because we like being parents. Uh, we like having healthy kids uh, to do that. So we were gifted from a friend of ours this crib and that mattress and oh, it looks really dirty but it's not anyway and it's a drop side if any, if any of you know anything about drop side cribs they're like really dangerous because the side could drop and like pinch an arm or cut circulation off or it's it's kind of dangerous so yes i'm using a drop side crib but i'm going to totally disable the drop side feature so that it doesn't the side won't drop right yet rendering it safe um like a funny talk show host. Anyway, so that's what I'm gonna do right now. And Darcy should be home like in the next 10 minutes or so. Let me see. Well, I still have to take someone home. What time is it? It's 8.24, so I probably got like 20 minutes. Let's see how fast I can put this thing together. That was totally quick. I did that in like 10 minutes. Because it's just like an Ikea type piece of furniture where you just have the screws all ready to go. So what I'm gonna do is I drilled a little hole right here because this is the drop frame side, this is the side that's um, dangerous because it slides up and down and the babies can, um, apparently the babies can like knock them down somehow and then it like can trap their arm or, I think I can get their head through there so I think it's just like an appendage sort of danger. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drill a nail or a screw straight into here and to lock this piece right up here from being able to slide up and down. Do that on both sides and then it's uh, perfectly safe. I finished just in the nick of time. I was putting the, the um, what is it called, the bed sheet on, and Darcy called me and told me they're outside, so I'm going outside right now. <gasps> Hi. Oh, I love you so much. Mm. What have you been doing? You're so sweaty. I know, I did something fun. I did something good for you. You did? Yeah. Hi, big Briggy. Hi, big boy. Hi. Can I give you, can you give me kisses and hugs? Are you sad to see me? Was he sleeping? No. Hi. Why do you look sad, oh Biggie God, Briggie? Hi, Ginger. Give me squeezes. So I'm so happy to see you guys. Did you have fun on the ride home? Yeah. You excited to see me now? Okay, let's go inside. Um, I'm in my house. I'm so excited. It has been a long day. The last bit since Phoenix has been rough. And I'm home and my husband looks so cute and I can't wait to just sit with him and just bite him. And um, he has some kind of surprise for me, which I'm really excited about, but I'm also kind of having anxiety. So we'll see about that. Home, oh, I'm in my house. So excited, it has been a long day. The last bit since Phoenix has been rough. And I'm home and my husband looks so cute and I can't wait to just sit with him and just bite him. And um, he has some kind of surprise for me, which I'm really excited about, but I'm also kind of having anxiety. So 
We'll see about that. Okay, Darcy, I spent a little, actually I spent the last 15 minutes doing this. Maybe 20 minutes doing this. And she's gonna open her eyes and see this thing right here. Okay, ready? Open. Open. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Now look behind you. <laughs> Where's all my crumbs? I need my crumbs! You're welcome, babe. But I really do need my crumbs. That's like the number one. The fan is in the living room. I've been sleeping hot. The fan, is, the fan is in the living room. Hi, cutie bubble dribble crumb. Hi, happy girl. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, isn't that good? Okay, and I totally made it baby proof or baby safe. You did? Yes. Right here on this side. What do you think? What did you do? Right here, I put a screw there. Oh, sweet. So this literally can't go up and down. Oh, cool. And on the other side, I put two screws. You're so cool, huh? I love you so much. I love you so much. I know, I love you too. Hazel, you like your new bed? She does. You like your new bed, Hazy Baby? Okay, I'm gonna get in bed. Time for bed. Everybody go to bed. Good night. Time to go to bed. Good night. Night night. Good night. Look. She knows. <laughs> She's like, yeah, right. I'm going to be up all night. All night. <laughs> you like your new bed, Hazel Basil? Is Daddy awesome? Yes. That's all you get in there. I'm taking a picture. Is that cool, Hazy Bell? Alex, it's awesome. Yay. He even found your girly sheet to go in there. Yep. Yes, he did. No, this no, is no. my kind of fishing, right here, people. No. Uh -oh. I have to catch two rings. The piranha earrings. Oh. Oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> and I like how you chose pink, babe. Oh. 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 Tell him no fish. Bring him. Bring him. Did that Ow. fish bite you on the finger? Did that fishy bite you on the finger? Ginger, what happened? Say like, no fish. No fish. Tell him, Brigham. No. <laughs> Ow. Fish Ow. got your finger. Ow. Say no fish. I should have taken off your hair. <laughs> he bit you for real? Just yank it off. Ow. Did it hurt you? Did the fake fish bite down too hard? Oh, now it's really hurting you too. <laughs> Tell mommy. Please. Say, mommy, take this fish off my finger. Owie. <laughs> Owie. Put it, squish it to the bottom and then it'll come off. Oh, oh, oh look, finger. he puts another one on. Fish I don't have on. any more sympathy for fish you. He's gonna bite your lip. Oh, oh no. 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 Oh. <laughs> he like it. Let me see. Oh. Um, nom 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 nom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Okay, we learned a cool trick. If you throw the fish in the air, the seagulls catch them and eat them. Watch, I'll find like a half dead one. Here we go. Here's one. There we go. 